What's going on, everybody? Thank you for uh, tuning into this week's episode of Pints and Putts. On today's episode, we have Jake uh, from a new brewery called Colorblind Bre- Colorblind Brewing, right? Artisanal no, ales, artisanal man. ales. That's Gotta right. Make it fancy. That's right. It's not That's just right. brewing, man. We're That's fancy right. brewers now. But you're also the quality control manager at Thimble. Thimble, Island. yeah, yep. Thimble, yeah. It was kind of a, you know, good partnership getting with them. You know, they're doing contract work, and there was a little bit of opportunity there to be able to get my beer into the tanks, and something that was kind of always a thought and an idea to be able to finally see it on paper, and then finally turn it into liquid, and then see it, you know, sitting on the table now, all in the course of, you know, I think it's been like three or four months since we've actually got the wow. Oh, shit. Yeah, it's been about a three-year idea for the brewery, four years of trying to refine how I wanted to do it, and being colorblind, this was a no-brainer to kind of go with. So, wait, it's, are you you're colorblind? Oh, Oh yeah, man. I'm, I'm. That's, that's I, awesome. I, I neutral mean, that, color. It's all neutral colors. That's, that's why sick, I don't go dude. crazy. Yeah, okay. man. It, it, yeah, I actually I suffer um, duton deficient. So reds, oranges, blue, purples, greens, browns, white, and pink. Um, anything that are somewhat close, but it's when the lighting hits it right that I can't differentiate the two. So I mean, you got four main kinds of colorblind, but I'm just in that kind of side of it. Ooh. Rains it. Jeez. He's also convinced that he he said he got high one night and he like convinced himself that he shouldn't be playing lefty. Yeah. reach out about it because they're like hey is that are you colorblind are you trying to make a joke about it and they're like what if i can't see it i'm like well listen i have it pretty bad and i have it so even if you're monochromatic and you only see black and white you're still going to be able to see labels now i have actual art made up for t-shirts that i won't be able to see okay Um, oh man that kind of sucks i mean well no it's kind of funny it's to be able to wear something where i'm just going to see the dots you know there'll be a hop in it but it's in colors i can't see so it's kind of i want to be able to teach some people that they're colorblind because a lot of people don't know Next question, favorite favorite club in the golf bag? Oh God, my driver. Really? Actually, okay. I, between well, that, that makes that, sense. yeah. I mean, I, I, I either that or you put my forty six degree in my All hand. All right, because that's what I was gonna say. We touched on earlier, like you can hit the ball a mile, or you, but you good count re- on your recovery. recovery. Yeah. yeah. So, so was, and that's I the would, thing. It, it's it it's. I would have to go a top three, honestly. Okay. Sure. Yeah. No. I love so that. It would be the forty six. I would definitely the driver because I mean, who doesn't love? To just, just, just unless just smoking unleash, right? a bomb, and then I mean, honestly, it would probably be my five iron because my there five iron, okay. I can place that back foot, keep it no more than ten feet off the ground, and still carry a just buck a forty. Nice slow stinger. Well, yeah, and for a guy who likes to get in the trees, you gotta be able to get it out. It's yeah. true. You, know? you gotta find those little gaps. <laughs> I gotta back off there. <laughs> More. That's it. This guy fucking messages me being like, "Oh, I'm, I'm gonna fuck you guys up." And then all of a sudden, I get my ass handed me. Home field advantage, right? Plenty of Stanley. 